This one was brought from Mintra. This had a side zip which I removed and I made front opening for the ease of uh, wearing and taking off because this is non-stretch and pure cotton. Unless it has some stretch, it is uh, very difficult to get off, get on and off through your head. So I just added the front button and uh, made a front opening and added some hooks and buttons. The length was great, so I did not alter the length. This was from Ajio. I cut off uh, the length. Uh, I need about uh, 15 inches. So accordingly, I cut off the length and I have added uh, folded at the bottom here and uh, added a, an elastic of about 1 inch. So that will fold in and not have too much loose under the pallu. Closer look. This need not. Uh, this needed no other alteration, since the fitting was fine, and it has a little bit of stretch. This material, which has kind of a texture to it, this will have some amount of stretch, so it is easy to wear from over your head and remove. This one was bought on Amazon. This one also needed a little bit of trim at the bottom. I reduced the length and added elastic. Also I reduced little bit of width of this. I'll show you closer how I took in some amount of cloth and made a seam inside. Like a dart. Folded, it and, folded and added elastic about 1 inch width of elastic one or two inches you can add this is the dart which I have added I don't know if it is visible on the black cloth like this I have taken some inch inside this is uh, the wrong side of the cloth and I have given such a seam just to reduce the width of the cloth you can as well do it on the side seam but I prefer to do it near the bust area on both the sides a tailor would know when you say so that you need a dart to reduce the width of it this is in navy blue this was brought on amazon this as well i reduced about four to five inches of length just to fit how it sits on my body on a closer look i'll show it already had a about two and a half inch or three inch of elastic i retained that and i just reduced the length and cut it off and i joined this top to the bottom width i have not reduced width seems to be okay the elastic is like so uh, when you already get such elastic it is nice and uh, lengthy consider the length while adding or reducing to the top this length as well this usually on wearing it just gets folded anyway after cutting i have just rejoined and given a zigzag i don't know if it's visible i have cut off for four to five inches and i have attached reattached this one to this top to this elastic i retained this elastic there are beautiful colors available on amazon on such tops if you want to alter this one purchased on Algeo uh, I thought it would fit without any alteration but it was very bulky at the bottom under the pallu it looks very huge because I'm on the XL size so it does add volume that's why I reduce I reduce the size and I cinch in the waist this I have just folded and added about a 2 inch width of elastic this is pure cotton as well this is little bit loose so it is okay to take off from your head and wear otherwise if it is little fitted again you have to preferably cut open in front and give a button or something so that you can wear it easily this was probably from uh, shopper stop i guess the same uh, this has had uh, major alterations as in uh, the, it came with the elastic I have took in the width as you can see this same 
yeah this seam and also I have reduced the length and reattached this elastic part it already had a front opening which was easier to take off and wear this i guess it is from the lifestyle stores this was a regular t-shirt or a top this had major alteration i took off the length and i have cut open in front as you can see and i have added uh, hooks and uh, eye to for closure also it had this uh, even the sleeves i had altered i mean the length of the shoulder but anyway this took too much of alteration and i wouldn't uh, suggest to go for such ones because it takes a lot of time and effort also it had this some lace detailing which i removed from the t-shirt and attached on the back of the blouse so that it will look nicer in the sari since back is much accentuated in the sari like so this is uh, sorry this is pure cotton as well this is the one blouse first blouse of mine or so called blouse or crop top it is usually called as blue zone i'll uh, put the spelling uh, this is what inspired me to take on more such blouses or anything to wear on sari which i like and prefer uh, this i got i got it from one of the roadside shops in jainagar it's some brand called yesika i don't know i'm not able i'm not able to find any other clothing from this brand anyway this is a rayon material and it already came with such elastic it sits beautifully also it has a boat neck and a bit of elastic on the sleeve as well this is 3/4 sleeve this no alteration has been done i just use it as it is this is another top which has had no alteration this i bought it on ajio in that orchid blues this is a synthetic in material i don't normally wear synthetic material so if you are okay to wear synthetic material then you have lot of options this did not need any alteration as such uh it has little bit very little of stretch but it's okay to put it over your head and remove and it has a side zipper also for such one if it is little tight you can cut open the front and add a button and a hook or anything hook and tie so it will be easier to take off and wear also as you can see on the back there is a little bit of elastic detailing Uh, this will cinch in the waist, so that's why this did not need much of alteration. At the bottom, it is preferable to have some amount of elastic, or it has to be really, really fitted uh, to look good on below sari, especially if you are large and excel. This is another top from Ajio, same like the maroon one shown earlier. This also have reduced the length and added elastic. Nothing else has been changed. Also, now I'm going to mention about the type of material I look for while buying, so that it is alterable. This is uh, cotton or rayon. Uh, I do not buy material which has some amount of elastin or uh, like a t-shirt type of material. Although it is cotton, because my machine is not equipped to stitch such material uh, like a t-shirt type of material, so I avoid that. i usually go for uh, pure cotton or rayon uh, you you need a little expert eye to get get to know the material on the website while just seeing the pictures uh, also another hint would be you can see the bottom line stitching it will have single stitching it is just uh, non elastic cotton or synthetic non elastic cotton or synthetic otherwise you have a double line stitching which i'll show later also if you wear synthetic you will have non elastic or non stretchable synthetics which you can bring and alter and wear since i do not i cannot wear synthetics these are the options i have usually i look for uh, cotton 
rayon viscose pure cotton has less of stretch rayon and some viscose viscose is a little uh, gambling that uh, it may be non natural material rayon is a mix of natural and synthetic material and it has a little bit of stretch and shine to it so it is easy to alter viscose uh, it is just a bet that you have to order see the material and many times i do send back uh, some of the material which i bring or the tops which i get and send it back because i find it difficult to alter also as anyone would know there were there are many stretchable crop tops that you can wear i don't prefer that how it sits on me and i don't like them so if you get a crop top with a stretchable material which mostly doesn't need much of alteration and it is easily wearable